So I just got back from running errands and today is such a crazy day. I mean, I was really tested because <laughs> the past few weeks I'm either in Manila in Pangasinan, uwi ako dito, then after a week I'm going back to Manila again, then Pangasinan. So it's it's a whole thing. And every time na nandito ako, usually kasi malakas yung ulan, so I'm just staying at home. And also I had to clean the house kasi nga there are a lot of molds and millipedes that I have to deal with. So, yeah, it's a whole thing. But this morning there was just so many things going on and I was really overwhelmed. So, far convinced me to really go outside and you know, um, run some errands, eat outside and one of the primary things that I had to go out rent is because I found molds on my pollen bag and I was devastated because it's like the entire morning there was just so many things going on and then when I got my bag I saw molds and there were quite there's there's quite a bit kahit sa mga stitching anyway it's parang yun yung breaking point so yeah I had to go out because you know I had to do something about it. So nagpunta ako sa doctor letter. Um, binigyan ako ng quote. Um, the options are cleaning and restoration. Pero parang yung cleaning is around four thousand pesos and the restoration is around seven thousand five hundred. Tapos palapad nyo yung magre repair. So kailangan yung inspect um, talaga if magagawa niya yung sa bag. So, they recommend rin yung restoration talaga um, para mas ma... what do you call this? Mas ma-prevent rin yung molds down the line. That's what they said. So, ayun. But I have to... Um, I brought it home pa rin. So, I have to bring it back. Uh, tas pag nandun na yung uh, talagang magre-repair, I have to leave it there for about 4 to 6 weeks. But, yeah, that pollen bag is, is my baby. So, I was really... I was really... I was really stressed out. Grabe talaga yung trauma na nabibigay sa akin ng mold. Anyway, after all that, um, nagpunta ako sa Ace Hardware because I have to get the humidifier, itong mga portable ones. And, unfortunately, yung maliliit lang yung meron. Pero kumuha na din ako. So, usually, by 3 yung pack niya. Bumili ako na. I bought two packs. Um, just gonna put this sa mga corners talaga. Cause it's honestly, I don't know. It's gonna get colder also the following months most likely. So I'm just really preparing myself. Oh, by the way, I actually got this one. Ito sa Lazada ko to binili. Ano siya? Um, aroma Stone Diffuser. Dahil rin sa mga millipedes and ants, I decided to get this one. Cause apparently, um, the smell of peppermint, um, hindi raw nila gusto. I've only tried it in my room so far. And I, I do think naman na nag-lessen yung, um, mga millipedes. But it looks like this. Mukha siyang bar of soap. Yeah. Tapos, um, I bought this one from Urban Home, yung brand niya. And it smells really nice. Amoy mentos siya. And I would just put a few drops and then... I'll probably put the rest. Kasi parang apat yung binili ko nito. So, tinry ko lang sa room ko. And it actually smells good rin. Even when you walk in the room. And ayoko rin kasi bumili nung diffuser na parang humidifier. Because I don't wanna add moisture um, sa mga rooms. So, yeah. I discovered this. It's an aroma stone. So, just wanted to share that. the next day and I'm feeling so much better you know yesterday I it's just it's like a whirlwind of emotions and I couldn't like see clearly the things will eventually uh, work out which it did which I am so glad I am feeling so much better 
my mind is so much clearer and yeah so for a minute there i forgot how things will eventually work out and like it always does but yeah i feel so much better today but i have to run errands again i have to go to school and process some papers for my enrollment so yeah that's the plan for today I just got home and grabe ang lakas ng ulan. Talaga, ngayon na lang ako ulit naglakad na parang grabe yung buhos ng tubig sa kalsada. Kasi rin usually, nasa bahay lang naman ako. But yeah, I, I wanted to try pa naman a new French bakery that opened. But yeah, maybe next time. And then, even if the weather was very gloomy, I also actually feel very happy. And like, uh, lucky girl syndrome. Kasi everything worked out well today like i feel like it's a complete 360 compared to yesterday because yesterday was just filled with it, with anxiety but today i'm feeling so much better yung mga pinrasos ko sa school it went really well and then i was also able to book a pilates class which i'm very excited about because it's one of like my um school break summer vacation <laughs> um bucket list so i'm kind of nervous because it's my first time and I'm not the most flexible person, but I'm ex I'm excited anyway. Good morning, guys. So I just finished getting ready because my titas are visiting Baguio, so I'll be spending the day with them. I think they're gonna stop by here. So last night, I made sure to clean the house, talaga. And I also kind of like decluttered yesterday, because with all the molds, um, I wanted to make sure to check everything that I have. To make sure that they're okay and i also wiped down some of the walls because there are some areas that i knew would easily get molds on them so yung parang talagang we wipe ko before but this time there are certain walls na parang bago sila sa akin na nagkaka molds din pala sila so you know have to take care of it and i remember my mom would always tell me that no one will care for your house the way that you would you know so given that i was able i was privileged enough now i got this newly constructed so partly you know i feel like i'm the one i'm the first one who live here so you know i, I get to really like take care of it so i'm just really happy and a clean house just makes me very happy and i'm just getting ready pa because they will arrive in about 30 minutes so yeah i'm just getting my stuff ready oh, and i also wanted to share with you guys this bag i don't think i've shown it in the vlog yet but this is my birthday gift for me <laughs> um this one is the kafuni uh stance wallet bag so if i'm anything i'm such a bag girly really i mean like compared to all the other things i am a huge bag girly and i'm trying to grow my collection slowly and i just i've been dreaming about her and i'm so glad that i got her I'm also really excited because it's finally um, a silver hardware. Because as you guys know, I wear a lot of like silver jewelry, so I feel like sobrang bagay niya. And it comes with a long strap and a handle over here, so it's very easy to like dress up or dress down. I've been using this quite a lot lately, so yeah, I am just I just wanted to share. If you guys are also interested, I will try to link their website into the description box. But yeah, it makes me happy because I've been dreaming about her for months and I don't know about you guys. I don't know what happened. Okay. Okay, this sound okay. But I don't know about you guys, but I'm the type to keep it like sa phone tabs, yung mga wish list or things that I'm looking to buy. And it, it was just very satisfying to finally remove her from the tabs and because she's here now. I will try to edit a bit later. I to film a bit later. 
um, of course, I still want to protect their privacy, but uh, and also mga seniors na sila, so hindi ko alam kung saan kayo pupunta. So yeah, I think it would also be interesting to see the places that they'd want to go because it's probably quite different from the things that I like. So yeah, I kind of like woke up and just want to make the dal. So yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Burnham Park and nakakatuwa kasi yung mga senior by kang gusto nilang activity pero supporting lang tayo kakain lang tayo dito ng mangga I'm so tired but for coming home with take out Hi guys, so I just finished my class and I actually feel very refreshed and light. I tried to film uh, a time lapse but natumba siya and I kind of like forgotten about it na because I was really just focused during the class. So I think that's also a good thing because I don't know, I am not the most flexible person but I really enjoyed it. I feel like it really, um, it really work on like different parts of my body because it's for beginners but it works on like full body workout so I really like how everything is very slow controlled and mindful so yeah I'll definitely explore their other classes because they also have yoga and there's also mat pilates so I'll definitely explore more but so far so good I also really like how it will help with my posture because I'm always on my laptop so I think that would also help me a lot so yeah medyo nginig pa ako nanginginig pa yung legs ko kanina during class but it's my first time and we got to try something new today so yes that's a win I'm very happy <laughs> 